Hi everyone, this is JD, your gadget review friend. We're continuing to review and compare devices, and you can check these updates on our Twitter community at GadgetRev now. Today's a speed comparison of two Snapdragon 765 5G processors. This is Google Pixel 5 versus LG Velvet 5G. Today's a speed comparison of two of the latest phones from Google and LG. We know that LG just stopped producing mobile phones this year, and this is a good video to ask a question, how good is an LG phone really? I know a lot of YouTube channels misrepresented LG phones that contributed to their downfall. Outside this camera comparison video, Google Pixel 5 is a very good camera phone first, and you can buy this around six to seven hundred dollars. While LG Velvet 5G sports a really good design, a bigger and curved display, and a headphone jack. This will cost you around three to four hundred dollars now. We will test synthetic benchmarks, boot up, screen refresh rate, application load time, and network download and upload speed to see what the difference are and who's better. Who will win? Hey, don't forget to subscribe, my friend. Let's go! On our first test, we will do synthetic benchmark using Geekbench 5. We will check how both phones process data on single core and multi cores. On this comparison test, we will also see how fast these phones process data while using all their available resources. We made sure we clear all open apps. Just to remind you, Google Pixel 5 will be on the left and LG Velvet 5G will be on the right. While waiting, these are the specs for both phones. You can check it out. I don't want to skip the test for transparency, so we will just speed up the video. After 4 minutes, LG Velvet finished first. Now we will check how long will it take for Google Pixel 5 to finish. So after 43 seconds, Google Pixel 5 also finished this test. Checking the synthetic benchmarks, Google Pixel 5 has a good score of 578 in single core and 1338 in multi cores, while LG Velvet has a better score of 580 in single core and 1723 in multi cores. Very good score for Snapdragon 765 5G. Let's see if we will feel it on real world test. Next is boot up test. We will turn off both phones and turn it back on to see who is faster. Operating system, network connectivity, and boot up animation may affect how fast this is. There you go, LG Velvet 5G is slightly faster than Google Pixel 5, so LG Velvet is the winner here. Next test is screen refresh rate. This affects the smoothness of the home screen and more for user experience. The smoother the transition, the faster it feels. Checking the screen technology of both phones, LG Velvet only has the regular 60Hz, but Google Pixel 5 has a faster 90Hz refresh rate. This will be helpful in gaming and smoothness of transition, so Google Pixel 5 is the winner here. Next is opening of apps. So we have three categories, light apps, medium apps, and heavy apps. Light apps are for casual users that don't do heavy tasks on their phone. These are mostly pre-installed apps for productivity, like calendar and clock. It's a tie on dialer. It's a tie on messaging. It's a tie on clock. LG Velvet is faster on Google Chrome. Google Pixel 5 is slightly faster on camera. It's a tie on settings. Google Pixel 5 is slightly faster on calculator. And Google Pixel 5 again is faster on calendar. Now let's try to relaunch these apps. So for casual users, whoever is cheaper and produce the same performance wins it. LG Velvet 5G is cheaper than Pixel 5, so LG Velvet is the winner here. 
Next is medium apps. These are essentially light apps but needing network connectivity with multiple functionality like social networking apps. These are for average users. It's a tie on Facebook. It's a tie on Facebook Messenger. It's a tie on Instagram. Google Pixel 5 is slightly faster on Twitter. LG Velvet is slightly faster on TikTok. It's a tie on Amazon app. And LG Velvet is slightly faster on eBay. Now let's try to relaunch these apps. So for social networking and shopping apps, still the same. LG Velvet will give you more value if you're an average user. So LG Velvet is the winner here. And lastly, heavy apps that need processing power, faster refresh rate, and stable internet connectivity. Let's see if the benchmark score are showing on real-world test. LG Velvet is faster on Subway Surfer. LG Velvet is slightly faster, but it's almost a tie. Google Pixel 5 is faster in 8 ball pool. LG Velvet is faster on Pokemon Go. LG Velvet is faster on Mobile Legends. Google Pixel 5 is faster on Netflix. And LG Velvet is faster on Disney+. Plus. Now let's try to relaunch these apps. So for heavy users, both of these phones are fast loading any games and streaming apps, and they made a fair share of wins and losses, no apps reloading, so it's a tie for me. And for our last test, the network speed test. We will check the download and upload speed when connected to the Wi-Fi. We will test one phone at a time. So Google Pixel 5 has a download speed of 95.3 Mbps and a 16.4 Mbps upload speed. Well, LG Velvet has 53.4 Mbps download speed and 16.5 upload speed. Almost the same upload speed but Google Pixel 5 won the download speed. So Google Pixel 5 is the winner here. So what is Gadget Revnow's verdict? The flagship Google Pixel 5 or the mid-range LG Velvet? To start with, Snapdragon 765 5G is a really good processor and if some people are off in buying Pixel 5 or LG Velvet because of the inferior processor, hey, you see how good it is? Put 6 or 8 gigs of RAM and that's all you need for a snappy processor. 
I will recommend Google Pixel 5 for anyone who needs a good camera flagship phone in a budget. This is a great phone. As Google Pixel 6 comes in, you might find this phone even cheaper. And I will recommend LG Velvet for anyone who loves to use their phone as entertainment. It has a big screen, a useful headphone jack, and a snappy performance. Disregard the pricing for these phones, I think LG Velvet is faster and will give you more value and functionality. Not the best camera phone, but a great and snappy performer. If you enjoyed this video, consider subscribing. We're posting videos of gadget reviews, comparisons, photography gears, and tips. The goal of this channel is to review and compare devices as simple as possible, concise, and friendly. Don't forget to drop your comment, like, and share. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.